Well, no matter the crisis or disaster, the Red Cross is there. All day we've shown you how they've responded to natural, natural and national disasters. Many volunteers, along with the doctors and nurses, also helped open large vaccine clinics at places like the United Center. Just being a Red Cross volunteer and having the Red Cross, you know, vest on was really, really um, very reassuring for people. I mean, the Red Cross brings a lot of, um, it, it just brings a good vibe. Well, Holly Baker with the Red Cross is joining us now. And Holly, that's so important to note. Last year, this entire telethon was virtual. This year, we're in person on a much scaled down version, but the entire time, the work of the Red Cross hasn't stopped. Yeah, definitely. Our volunteers are always at the ready. They're always ready to go, uh, so enthusiastic and wanting to help as many people as they can. So even when things started to change, we just adapted right along with it. And our volunteers responded virtually. They were on the phone. They figured out ways to do things differently. So we were always staying safe and making sure that any person who's experiencing a disaster has the help and assistance that they need from a Red Cross volunteer because we say we respond to disasters large and small, uh, here and far, locally, nationally, but really every disaster is big to the person going through it. And we're so grateful for all our volunteers who are there to help everyone going through something like that every step of the way. Yeah, it can happen any moment. Speaking of disasters, Holly, you work for the Red Cross, but you were also recently uh, deployed. Yeah, recently I was in Louisiana for Hurricane Ida. Uh, to help with the recovery work happening there. I've also been to Florida for Hurricane Irma, and that's actually when I was deployed internationally to the Bahamas for long-term recovery work for Hurricane Dorian. So even once the disaster seems far away, when it's no longer in the headlines, the Red Cross is still there responding for years, even afterwards. So I was there for about a year and a half. Wow. Thank you for what you do, and thank you for joining us, Holly. Yes. Yes, Incredible thank you so work. much. We're serious about helping the Red Cross here at CBS. How serious? Take a look. This is our behind the scenes staff. That means producers, technical crew, managers, all wearing red to support the Red Cross. Great job, everyone. Team effort. We'll be right back.